Allison is the most, her assessment of this whole thing was spot on. Okay? And that's why when I did the video addressing Odessa, I told her, I said, whatever it is that you, or she said that she counsel people. Just on this internet with the done self running them out, getting in trouble, even after being served, you still come on the internet for that cunt. Giving me more evidence for carry the court. I sit in the fucking house a while so we will get people money. I can understand it, right? I know we is Guyanese. You cost me, I cost you. And are you going to sue fucking people? Forget people money. Allison is the most her assessment of this whole thing was spot on. Okay? And that's why when I did the video addressing Odessa, I told her, I said, whatever it is that you, or she said that she counsel people. Because it hurts me when I see that Rhonda gets sued. Right? It very fucking hurt me for see a two Guyanese influencers and one guy in a sue one. It never said well. Reach to the point in your life. Whatever happened, happens. <laughs> Nothing. That's me mentality these days. Whatever happened, happens, cunt, mommy. Never, you don't bother, bother me with nothing. Human rights activists, since when? Where is the evidence for that? What have you done for the um for your community? Show us, please. And them things y'all do, Rondo. Are you Mary Rondo? Are you funeral Rondo? Eh? And still, are you still going to put um sue for Rondo? Here's your turn. Sir, I don't have no money <laughs> to take no authority. <laughs> your Honor, <laughs> let me tell your mother's done something. It did not happen. That's it. Okay. So, if you feel you're going to court and bluff a judge, no, sweetie, that's not how it works in America. Come with back, kids. Welcome back to the flight. Hit that subscription button, buddy, and stay updated with everything that's trending in Guyana and the diaspora. Thanks. Why are you wasting me time for going to fight last week for the world? So, you for what? I don't have the time or the energy, like I said, I'm not going to get into the details of this here. I'm going to court with no fucking attorney. I'm not seeking legal advice. We can go to the court and we can figure it out. So where's your attorney? Sir, I don't have no money to take no authority. <laughs> your Honor, <laughs> let me tell your mother's gone something. It did not happen. That's it. Case done. Now let me do what I want to do. Me never take stress no matter I have stress in my life. I always stress him about something or the other thing. You know me, I don't be stressing no more. Um Me never man, like me got the patience to stress about nothing. You, you ever reach to the point in your life but whatever happened, happens. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's me mentality these days. Whatever happened, happened, stunt, mommy. Never, you don't bother, bother me with nothing. No hot up. I wish you didn't come to this. Um, I think your child father is a billionaire. He got your back. <laughs> well, your mom to last. Suit he got. I might have forgot he back. Do a come to suit or time wasting. Like I said, I'm not taking no attorney, so I ain't suing nobody. Alright? <laughs> I ain't suing nobody, man. Keep doing what you're doing. They keep trying to bring you down, love you. Let me, let me, let me, let me tell you the hate. Let, 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 let me tell you what jealousy is. Oh, let's talk with Rhonda Bob and she 48,000 followers. And um, the plaintiff have... 115,000 followers. What, what, what's the number on top of this Facebook page, Lisa? What's the number on top of this Facebook page? They couldn't even give me credit for the amount of followers I have. 87 plus 50,000. That's how much. 
137,000. Yeah, I make a mistake. Yeah, I need to go and correct this. 137,000 followers I have on Facebook, man. 48,000. That's what they give me credit for. Oh, Jesus Christ. And this is just Facebook. It's ridiculous. Like, yeah, I can't even give somebody credit for amounting to the amount of followers that they got. Sad. Anyways, I can't get into details of that, but if you are one to read the story, they're from Guyana Uncut, okay? They released the whole story in details, put up with big picture on that there. It's on Guyana Uncut. Thank you to, Gu to Guyana Uncut for at least finding a decent picture with me. You understand? Because I know they don't like me at all. They leak my nude pictures. They um, they run stories after stories after stories about me. Mm -hmm. So thanks, Gayan and Uncut. At least you find a decent picture. This is the thing. Um, how are this thing get to Gayan and Uncut? That's what I know. <laughs> I need to. <laughs> how are these things reach to Gayan and Uncut? That's what I know. But some people, we don't have a court date as yet, ma'am. Um, we will have a motion hearing. And then, we, then we'll see how the case will move forward. That's it, but we don't have a court date as yet. At least I don't. Um, hey, good afternoon. Take a, and cool it out. It is my, no, I good, I good. I just do it my live, sweetheart. JB, I good, sweetheart. I just do it my live, and I got another live for you later. And, um... Yeah, we don't have, so sue them for the funeral they did for you. I'm not suing nobody. Why would I sue them? That, that's the thing. They said things, I said things. Now, uh, Allison, I think, okay. I think Allison, Allison is the most, her assessment of this whole thing was spot on. Okay? And that's why when I did the video addressing Odessa, I told her, I said, whatever it is that you, or she said that she counseled people. It's only one set of people that she counseled is be affected by things. And I did do that video calling Odessa out on that because she talks about, oh, and what you say could affect uh, Lola, whatever the case is. But what Lola then was saying, well, everybody was saying doesn't affect me because this here is straight so I can't feel but everybody else could feel so I think um, Allison assessment of this whole thing was spot on she's a hundred percent correct with the entire thing that she said and um, she didn't take nobody's side she speak However, she side go down because she was on both people pages, everybody page. And that's why she said, with all that you and your friends then did or attack that girl, y'all still come around for sushi. That's the thing. Yeah, what Allison say is absolutely correct. Absolutely correct. She was spot on on that thing there spot on but you see a lot of people are not going to speak out publicly about this here because they're scared and it's okay to be scared it's classified as extortion a simple google search will tell some of them that and are, are, are those that claim to be working at lawyers office and don't know what the fuck they're talking about just on this internet with the done self running them out getting in trouble even after being served you still come on the internet for that cunt giving me more evidence for carrying the court how dumb like how somebody could be done could be done to 10 people like how you understand then put out a whole petition about you go make up your own 
how you could make up own, how you could write a, a petition about yourself. Oh, a fan wrote this for me. No, a fan didn't wrote. You wrote that yourself. A fan wrote. Okay, okay. Human rights activists. Since when? Where is the evidence for that? What have you done for the um for your community? Show us, please. Because I'm a human rights activist. I'm an activist. I'm a social activist. I'm a political activist. And I have all my paperwork and my evidence to back it up. You understand? And every single thing. Including numerous awards for the work that I do. Both locally and internationally. So, if you feel you're going to court and bluff a judge, no, sweetie, that's not how it works in America. Come with backings. Because I, Melly Mel, don't bluff. You understand? I don't bluff. I don't come on this internet and lie on anybody. I don't come on this internet and abuse and cuss out and go on like... Well, I did that in the past of you, but this was warranted. And even though when I do that, I got things in my phone to back it up. If you decide that you want to take it to court or you want to go to the station, I could prove consistent, consistently I have evidence of you harassing me or bullying me on this internet. If I've ever done that. Illegal immigrants have a lot of rights that they don't even know. So don't nobody come on this internet and fool y'all and, and try to bluff y'all about what they can call ICE or they can call immigration. It is illegal to tell somebody that. And I want y'all that like tell people that nonsense, that it's illegal. And you can be charged for that. It's a crime to tell some to tell an, to tell somebody that you're going to call, uh, somebody that you know is illegal that you're going to call ICE or them, or you're going to call immigration and make, no. Delta 9 family, welcome back to the flight. No, even though, no, it seems like nobody is willing to bury the hatchet. It seems like nobody is going to let this one go. It seems like when this whole situation transpired, it hit certain persons in places when it comes down to the ego allegedly that look right now you know burying no hatchet you know letting nothing go pay me see what i'm saying and look you hear her and the say so i don't think that she's willing to say i can give a public apology for whatever my transgressions might have been because she allegedly is saying that she feel like if she was violated as well in the funeral and everything else that went on so with that being the case seems the matter now got nothing to do but to go in the direction that it is already going building up and building up to be more hot because look right now guyana social media war is hot it is hot right here in our kind of millions and millions of US dollars being thrown around the place. Plus, news just in 100 million more. A hundred million more on you know who. But we can save the one for another video. Because that's crazy right there. That is a whole other situation. But Afi. What you got to say about this whole incident? Because I know you follow up with this thing even more than me with the ladies. Now, what's going on? From your perspective, what do you see in this situation, eh? Wow. It is crazy. I'm tuned in every day. People don't want to let stuff go. And some people have every right to feel the way that they were feeling because their feelings were hurt because of some of the things that were said. But we as women, we shouldn't, you know, tear down each other or fight with each other, you know? 
that's just my feeling about it. Maybe they could come to a middle ground. I mean, they all live in the same state. They may see each other at the same functions. Do you mean when you see me as war? I don't know. But let <laughs> me get right into what Auntie Allison's saying right now. Because Auntie Allison, she got a point that she's making. And we want to pay some attention to what Auntie Allo have to say. And then guess what? Y'all go down in the comment section and give me your feedback. Let me know how y'all feel about what's going on right here. Because guess what? This social media war is hot. I'm feeling happy right now. I'm feeling nice. And I keep, I come to tell you, I you be careful of what you are saying on that blue amp. I you be very careful. People suing. Are you? Some people want to sit in the fucking house. I want to people get people money. I can understand it, right? I know we is Guyanese. You cost me, I cost you. And are you going to sue fucking people? Forget people money? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No, 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 no. No. And Rhonda, Rhonda, um, what should call it again? Rhonda Bob is a Facebook influencer. Melly Mel is a Facebook influencer. All two of them, right? And now allegedly, it's allegedly all to them is troubling the guy and the president. Them is go on on the program and talk about the president and talk about this and talk about that, the cussing the body, cussing the body, right? And what I saying, right? Because it hurts me when I see that Rwanda gets sued, right? It very fucking hurt me to see a two Guyanese influencers and one guy in a sue one. It never said well one. You know, like how me situation, one said this one carrying out cocaine, and the one said the one carrying out cocaine. Them just trouble up one another, abuse it, and of course go up on TikTok or up on Facebook. I really know, right? And then one guy in a sue one. Malo, Guyanese. No, 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 no. No. I come to talk. I want to run the air good wise saying. I want Melly Melly a good wise saying to you. I don't know. I don't pick sides with people. I don't pick no side. I don't side. I don't size up. When something hurt me, I just come and talk. Me if I get sued for fucking out. I that no dumb girl. I get human rights. I have right to talk. Cause nothing can fucking hurt me, and I keep it to myself. Y'all understand me? Nothing can hurt me. Me keep it to myself. I got right to talk. I can live in the fucking court all the time for coming out and talk about human rights. No. Eh, 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 eh. The one it is sitting good on my fucking neck at all. It is sitting good with my neck. Eh? Everybody is troubling everybody from Facebook. Eh? But let me tell you something. How oh, must tell you? Anyhow, yeah, Billy Life, Billy Life. I have build a life. I come for talk. And let me tell you something. With all them things, Aliana, your friend, do run the. Are you still going to sue the girl? Eh? All them things are you do run the wait, wait. We black people. We fucking black people. Eh? Now because run this an Eastern, you know, a coolie. Whatever we want for such as a coolie girl. Whatever we want for say, no discrimination. Eh? All them things y'all do run the. Are you very run the? Are you funeral run the? Eh? And still, are you still going to put. Um, super random 100% wild crafted CMOS from nature by natives. Why pay more? He look at the perception that is created about him by smelly smell. A fucking known entity degenerate hungry belly low life woman.